So, hello guys, welcome back to Plosive Projects and today we are going to make smart home automation project with ESP32 and Alexa. And at, I was quite a sick for a few days, almost 12 days and I couldn't upload any video. That's why today I thought that I am little bit better. So I thought that I should make a video and upload as soon as possible for my audience to be entertained so uh, today we are going to make as i as you know thumbnail you have uh, seen the thumbnail you have seen the captions um, today we are going to make a smart home automation project so i for a, a couple of days 12 days i was just searching for some smart home automation devices uh, those were some electronic devices which were linked with Alexa and Google Home but those were quite the price was quite high so I thought that we have Alexa we have ESP32 why should I why should that waste uh, I should make something so we are with a sample project and you will know why this is a sample project in my future videos so uh, we are going to make this with ESP32 and Alexa and that's all no third-party applications um, so let's begin so before we start we will need some components they are ESP32 relay module jumper wires and breadboard we also need some AC appliances as we are controlling a bulb with Alexa. So they are bulb, bulb holder, AC wires, red, black, slash white, and a two-pin plug. You can take a look of these components or take a screenshot. So let's move on to our coding program. So guys, we are now on the coding program this is the first thing we have to make sure in this project so this is the coding program i will give you all the coding file code and circuit files in the description below do check out okay so these are some including functions and you have to see that if you you have to download this thing esp alexa from the library manager and this is the ASP Alexa you have to just type there and you will sh uh, the library will show ASP Alexa by Christian Schwein okay now you have to check that what is you have to just edit your uh, Wi-Fi name my Wi-Fi name is this and this is the password SSID means the Wi-Fi name actually and we are going to connect our relay on 18 pin number 18 in on ESP32 of course this is the yellow bulb which is my device name or I can just put this as bulb right there I have a yellow bulb so just like that okay and these are some things which are going to be commanded to our Alexa and if the relay pin will be low then it will be on high then off okay and you have to make sure that your serial your serial uh, monitor is on double one five two double zero okay so in this you have to first check that you have uh, downloaded ESP Alexa then edit these things and that's all you if you want to this is optional to be edited yellow bulb okay and that's all about the coding problem so this is the core and this is the circuit diagram so guys let's go and let's move to our uh, uploading part so guys we are going to upload this program to ESP32 so, so let me plug this in
yeah so you can see the esp32 is now on now let's go and upload this code to esp32 So guys, our code is now verified and it's okay. Now this is going to be uploaded to our ESP32. It took a lot of time actually. And it's done. Now let's go to our serial monitor, double one five two zero zero. And now it is connected to B1108. IP address this is the IP address but it's not worth so now let's go to our Alexa setup and see how should we do the Alexa uh, how should we train Alexa so that this device can go and we can just turn on <coughs> turn on our bulb with this only a uh, voice command so let's go so guys we will learn how to uh, do the Alexa setup for our device to be con con uh, connected and be controlled by Alexa with this phone and also with uh, the Alexa 4th gen or those electronic devices okay so I think you can see the screen right there of this mobile so I am on the Alexa home page right there and here is the so we have to go in devices then in there is a search button there is a plus button in here so we have to just click there then add device then we have to go to others right at the bottom then wi-fi then discover devices and it will discover so we have to take a minute So I still then you can just go down and you can just subscribe my channel and then share this video so that every everyone can get the knowledge that there is something like this. Uh, we can make our smart home and I am going to do like that only. So guys, the this Alexa has found and light and has been connected to it. So let's do next. And this one suggests that where is your light, just tap that skip button. Then this also skip. And yellow bulb is set up and ready to use. Done. And now you can see that the yellow bulb is recently added and it is just power on. It is power off. It is actually working. So I will give you the trial in actually my Alexa is out. So I will give you the trial there. So let's go there. Alexa, turn on bulb. Okay. Alexa, turn off bulb. Okay. Alexa, turn on yellow bulb. Okay. Alexa, turn off all bulbs. Okay. So guys, have you seen the trial uh, of the my Alexa? So it was good, right? So if you literally connect many relays on that, so you can literally change it by yourself also. And there are some NeoPixels, NeoPixel strips. 
then you can also tell Alexa that change color to this and this and that will be so amazing so I am going to do that also with this because this is the sample and the real will come after some months we can say so thank you guys have a nice day excellent day Jai Hind Jai Bharat Oh, oh, oh.